a behind-the-scenes look at the effort to provide thousands of meals to local seniors. In the special report, Bola Badabo highlights the Meals on Wheels program. Good morning. Hello. How are you doing today? Okay. Doing good? Thank okay. you. Okay, don't let the kitty out. The Redmond Senior Center serves 32,000 meals a year through its Meals on Wheels program. Something that I never had before, but of course I worked all the time, but I never had a meal delivered. And I just, well, I can't say enough good about it. 88-year-old Adine Weimer spent more than 30 years working in retail and is a recent leukemia survivor after fighting the disease for the past 45 years. I couldn't think of a thing that they could do more of. I would like to have fried chicken. I will eat a Meals on Wheels early because it gives you more energy. <laughs> and if I have another one in my freezer, yeah. I'll have it for dinner yes. around 3.30. The meals are pre-scheduled and cooked at the Redmond Senior Center. Christy and other volunteers deliver them. Twelve go in here, so I usually come in and count and make sure that I have enough food for everybody. There's just a lot of uh, seniors that are not able to motate and get to the grocery store or drive. I was in the hospital, had heart surgery, and I needed help. With her heart condition, Lori Uding would have struggled to prepare meals. Now, she looks forward to the baked fish meals. So you said you've been doing this since 2020. Correct. What encouraged you to do this? Um, well, my dad got meals on wheels the last month of his life, and just paying it forward. I just love these people. Are you going to behave yourself today? I doubt it. I doubt it, too. <laughs> Although the nonprofit receives $180,000 in government funding, the program relies heavily on donations from the community for an additional $220,000. Recently, a Passion for Pets program was added so seniors can feed their pets well, too. So far, 25 of the 150 Meals on Wheels recipients use the service. So tell me, what's the most challenging part about this job? Hmm. Um, Probably because you just want to do more for it. All these wonderful angels come every day and give us all a beautiful meal. I like fried chicken. <laughs> to be eligible for the Meals on Wheels program, adults 60 and over must be homebound or need help cooking or shopping. Bola Badebo, News Channel 21.